You have a clubhouse? Wonderful to have a local who can show us around. There it is. Finish it. After a long day, Isaac is bringing Kendra some disturbing news. Good morning. We are all ready and out of the house on time this morning, which feels impressive. And we're looking nice. We are headed to church. As we travel the world this year, when it's possible, when we can, we are excited to go to different churches around the world. It's a great place to meet people and to share faith together. The church was delightful. Now we're back home, chilling. I'm getting all the wine bottles out. Now we hope those don't fall because they're glass. You want to see our clubhouse? You have a clubhouse? We're cleaning it up. It's really dirty. Okay. But it's really good so far. Really much better. You're clearing out all of the yucky stuff. Yucky stuff? No, oh, it's just gonna thank us. Mm. I'm glad you found a clock. It's a grandpa clock. With a grandpa clock. It's a grandpa clock because it doesn't work. <laughs> Isaac and Elise just got back from Aunt Shauna's and they brought home yeah. brioche. Oh, is that it's like rolls with like a creamy thing in the middle, like a yogurt cheese. Uh, Custard. And she said they're best when they're fresh. So. Okay. Is it good? Yeah. Mm. It's good? It's so soft. Aunt Shauna ordered these special for us. Mm. I like it. Mm. I mean, it's bread. The sweet roll. Bread. Whoa. As with it's all things quite... European so far, Very it's not light. too sweet. Most American things have so much more sugar. All right, they finished the fort. You're allowed to come in though. Do you remember what it was? Kids club. Wow, you did clean it out. They took everything. And I made this drawer for this thing. I'm going to eat and do the fans. So Thomas is a snowboarder. And this is his avalanche bag. And once a year, you gotta check it to make sure that it still functions appropriately so it can save your life if necessary. The avalanche makes one thing with you. It turns it around this way, this way, and this way. And this one has to be stable on your body. So even for, yeah. you know? Yeah. That's why I took this one between your legs. Okay. It's only for safety. So. And hold it. Push. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> and now you are safe from the avalanche. And then I ride down it. Uh -huh. no, Sorry? That's just so you're. That's just so that it, the snow doesn't completely cover you. So this protects you, it creates a space. That is cool. The avalanche bag. Let's go! They're getting herbs out of the herb garden. Down right here, right? Yeah, exactly. It smells amazing. I love fresh herbs. Yeah. Is that mint? No, this, no, this, is this I don't know what that is, to be honest. We have mint, I have wild mint growing back there, and then in the front, I think she has this some. This is your mint. time. Yeah, this is the time. And, and this there's is, the rosemary. This is really, woo. Oh, smell it. Toothpaste. What we can do is mm. take Peppermint. some and then like make put one in water upstairs mm -hmm. and just let it sit for a while and see how it tastes. Just to try it. What do you think? Yeah? Let's do it. So now they have the tracking system on that is used that you would wear if you did get into an avalanche to be able to be discovered. It's a tracker. It's like hot, hot, hotter, hotter. And it shows you the distance. Cool. And Thomas had to use this one time. There was an avalanche. So now you're playing hide and seek. So Shana was explaining that here in Germany, in her community where people will live in a lot of apartments, they will rent a yard. And it's not right by their house. Like this is right on the riverbank, but they have a little spot of land that they're able to plant, maybe build a little hut. They can't sleep there, they can't stay there but it's their little yard. That's so cool. It's like a little cabin that you just can't sleep in. You can spend there all day. Yeah. It's so wonderful to have a local who can show us around and teach us about what's going on here. So Shana was born 
in the United States, but for the last 20 years, more than 20 years, she has lived here in this city. They've been picking dandelions for the turtles. So because Shana lives right by the river here, she's just explaining how they have to try to control flooding. There have been times where flooding has come right up to their apartment and flooded the basement area there. And so they try to have these floodplain areas, almost like a third river that runs through the town to try to protect from the flooding. He's playing basketball. There you go. <laughs> H-O-R-S to nothing. Let's finish it off. Oh, I wanted it! Can I come back? Here we go. Finish him. Boom! Oh! Here we go, H-O-R-S. Will Isaac make this? Hopefully he doesn't. Oh! So I just beat Isaac and horse H-O-R-S-E. And then to he nothing. has me right now, H-O-R-S. To nothing. So we just are we're going back and forth. There it is. That could be it for me. If he misses this, I win. Oh. Yes! GG. I get a second shot, don't I? Oh yeah, you do. I wasn't doing it backwards. That would have been awesome. <laughs> Found a little kitty. Alright, so after just a stroll around town playing some basketball, we're coming home for a meal here at Shauna's house. And by the way, the turtles and everything are not Shana's, that's a neighbor's here in the apartment. But she's kind to pick things for them to eat. Smell this from long away. It smelled really good. And I was like, maybe that's what we're eating tonight. You said that's our dinner. Yeah. I love this quote. I'm sorry for what I said when I was hungry. That means it's almost time. We're setting the table, getting it all ready to go. The meat is done, and now we get to see the creation of the sauce, which they start with the drippings, Add some water. This is some all natural bouillon, so everything's gluten free for Caleb. So, when the sauce was done, we put the meat back in to warm it up. It's gonna be delightful. The sauce tastes so good. Yeah, do you see how to make it? Mm -hmm. This meal looks amazing. I can't wait to try this. So, a really important difference between the States and Germany is with their water bottles, the lids don't come all the way off. And we which think is that's so genius. Which is convenient. You can't lose the, the lid. Germans hate that. Oh, do they? <laughs> they're they're like trying to get it off and you're trying to drink out of it. Yeah. And it's like, yeah. Jonah was saying it's a newer thing yeah. and so okay. it kind of threw people off, but it makes a lot of sense. We're impressed with the water bottles. Yeah. After a long day, Isaac is bringing Kendra some disturbing news. What do you think? I think Isaac's taller. You, you're like up on your feet, flat footed, flat footed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, now it looks like Kendra might be. Hey, what Kendra's do you think? Who's taller? Oh, uh, I'm. Okay, what do you think, Elise? <laughs> I think Isaac is Isaac's taller. Isaac's taller. Yeah. Oh, she's stretching. She's trying so hard. <laughs> Isaac, you did it. You have two kids taller than you now. <laughs> Our twins. Oh, wait, wait, can I try? Oh, back to she, that. She's. Oh, her butt's higher than mom's. Whoa. That's actually getting pretty close. Is there a little, like, ground difference? Here? <laughs> okay, you guys are all still, about the same. She's still shorter. But just by a tiny bit. The big question is which country will Isaac overtake Elisa? Germany. <laughs> We're in Germany now. <laughs> He's hoping for it. All right, this Airbnb has some games. We're gonna play phase 10 before bed. And for some reason it surprised me, but it's all in German. Mm. Isaac, the first fave is zwei Drillinge. Two something else. Two sets of three. You guys ready to play? Let's do it. That's what I'm Isaac's doing. going all the way out. Three, two. <gasps> what? Oh. Again. Oh. He did it again. All right. I did it again. I was so close. I was you were so close. Well, Dad and I are kind of catching up now. Aussetzen. I we put on one skipped. ahead. Of I all got of skipped. Yeah. Aussetzen means sit out. Skip. Good night. See out. Now we're entering the actual festival. Nice and shining armor. Yeah. She fell. <laughs> 
Chao.